Welcome to my updates. Today we will discuss about formatting in Excel. How to format text in Excel in very simple way. Okay. Firstly, start with format. If you want to bold any text, just click on this option. The text will be bold. If you unbold, again click on this option. Text will be unbold. Okay. The shortcut key is Control B. Bold for Control B for unbold. Same. If you want to italic the text, just click on this option for italic, and again this option for uh, for reversal. Okay. And thirdly, if you want to underline any text, okay, just click click on this uh, this option. And again, click on this option to normalize. Okay. The shortcut key is under uh, Control U. Okay. Next, if you are to border any text, just go to uh, Found option and click on All borders, and then OK. You will see border will appear. If you want to disappear, to Control Z is the undo undo command. It will be disappeared like this. Okay. If you want to change the background uh, background color of uh, text, you see you will see this option for back change the back background color. Like fill color, color the background of cell to make them stand out. Okay. Choose the color and click on, uh, click on the color. Okay, now background color change to yellow. If you want to change the text color, so just click, uh, choose this option as, as seen is A, caps A. Choose the color and select the color. Now color will be changed to red. If you want to change the text font style of the text, okay, these are the font style. Currently showing Calibri. If you want to change, change Algerian, Arial Black. What do you want? Whatever you want, you can change it. Okay. Next option is text font size. If you want to increase or decrease text font size, just choose this option. These two options. Okay. This one is increase increasing text font size, and this option will decrease the text font size. One more option is available. This one. 26, 28, 36. You will see text font size will increase. Or if you want to decrease 8, 9, 7, the text font size will be decreased. Now I'm choosing 20. Okay. Alignment. All these options are using for alignment. Okay. Firstly, firstly is the text align left. Now, if you see currently shown text align is left, left side. If you want to change the alignment. Uh, to middle to just click on this one. I am increasing size of column. You will see text size is middle. Align is middle. Now, if you want to right side to text, uh, text uh, alignment is right side. Okay. Now I am I am using simple method. Just left. Okay. This one is middle, or this one is right. You can do it. Okay. Merge cell. If you want to merge any cell, so just click on merge and center. Firstly, you have to select it, select the range, and after that, merge and center. Click on merge and center. Okay. The us all, all the cell will merge. Anything you can type. Okay. You see, it show it shown in below below uh, below of the cell. If you want to bottom uh, instead of bottom, you want to you want in center center in the text, or you want to top in the text. So just click on these options. These are for top. These are for center, and these are for bottom. I am choosing this option. If you want to unmerge, again click on uh, merge and center cell. It will be click uh, uh, unmerge. Okay. I am again using Ctrl Z. Because I have to 
use this option also wrap text okay wrap text means if you want to change the position of the text just click on wrap text no sorry first firstly i will discuss about orientation of the text if you want to change the text direction so use use one this click this option if you want to ro rotate up click on rotate up if you want to uh, rotate down choose rotate down the text text will move accordingly okay if you don't want to so just click on control z control z okay now we are discussing about discussing about wrap text okay you see uh, column size is uh, column, column size is less than sentence if you want just uh, your, uh, your, uh, your whatever you are written it will it will be no, uh, not uh, go to the d, uh, d size so then use this option of wrap text what you see the column size remains same but row size will according to change like this one okay if you don't want wrap text just click on again this is unwrap text okay these are the option are formatting alignment now discuss about number if you want to change the number of style like uh, if you want to decimal place or you want to decimal place so just increase the decimal for this way and <coughs> decrease decimal from this way okay if you want comma so you uh, you will use this way okay same if you want to change the style of date so there are uh, there are one option available from this if you click on this number format that you can change the date format currently showing dd mm yy if you want to change to like this way so just choose this option and okay click on okay now style will be changed of the date. If you don't want to choose Control Z, okay. Now, last one is we discussing about currency. If you want to, uh, if you want uh, any currency, sim uh, simply in the, uh, in this field. So that's just click click on same thing. You uh, you can choose number and uh, go to currency and whatever currency you want, you you can select it. Okay, I'm selecting just like dollar sign. So you will see the dollar sign will appear on the currency. Okay, if you want to change the currency, one more one more option are level. Choose euro. Euro. Okay. So like this, this way you can change the currencies symbol also. Okay. These are the basic basic formatting of the uh, in in the Excel because we are. Uh, normally use this option these options that's why i'm discussing still if you are facing any problem please comment me and i will try to resolve the problem please like and subscribe my channel for more videos thank you